Hey everybody, how you doing out there? It's yours truly. I'm going to come with you with the sad story uh, this day and age. I know it's the year 2020, but I want to talk about this so-called 9-11. Now folks, if you haven't, haven't heard it yet, we are 19 years, this coming September, of 9-11. The 19th anniversary of 9-11, this September of 2020. Uh, 19 solid years since 9-11 hit the Trade Center. Uh, World uh, Trade Center attacks. 19 years this coming September. Um, I don't know if you guys realize this. It's been 19 years since that fateful day, that morning, around uh, quarter to nine, when everything was going great until a plane hit one of the uh, World Trade Center. And it kind of it kind of went in really fast. It kind of the airplane kind of zoomed in and it slammed the World Trade Center. Um, this is 19 years ago. 19 flipping years ago. Can you believe it? To this day, it's been 19 years ago since 9/11 did happen. This coming September of 9/11. And why am I talking about this? Because it's been 19 years. And I want to tell you about through my story. And my story, um, I saw a bit of it that morning of 9-11. I was watching like everybody else around the world that morning of 9-11 when it all happened on TV. Uh, I was watching on CNN at the time. I didn't know much about CNN, but I knew it was in New York City. Two places just hit the Twin Towers. And everybody was going haywire. And I'm not just kidding, folks. Everybody went haywire with 9-11. Uh, if you were down where the Twin Towers were, the Twin Towers, uh, Twin Towers uh, Center was in New York City, in the city, in the city area, 9-11 did happen. Uh, but it happened 19 years ago. 19 flipping years ago, folks. We are coming up to this 19th anniversary of 9-11. Why am I saying this now? Because here we are in July. We're in July now, and I want to speak of 9-11. A lot about uh, survivors, people who survived that 9-11. Now, I'm not going to speak to everybody who had survived 9-11, who didn't survive 9-11. I'm not here to do that. All I'm here it is 9-11 did happen in the year September, was it September 11th? Yeah, September 11th, 2001, that fateful morning. It's about quarter to nine. Uh, a plane just hit the Twin Towers. Uh, there's about five airplanes up in the sky. Uh, they were hijacked. Uh, I don't know if you heard it through all those videos on YouTube. It was hijacked. Um and these planes were about to hit, they were hijacked. These people, these so-called men, as they say, hijacked the flipping uh, airliner plane. Zoomed it right into the, uh, it was low attitude, uh, low, how do you say it? Low attitude of the airplane. Now, in case you didn't know, airplanes fly above buildings, not below buildings. Um, People were looking up there, and all of a sudden, a plane comes right where the center of the uh, New York City area zoomed right claw, uh, across. Uh, apparently, there was a film crew that filmed the actual the actual when the plane hit the building. Um, there was a news. Uh, uh, there was a film crew down there, down where the streets are. They uh, they point the camera way, way, way up there on the uh, World Trade Center. Way trade seven. This is a film crew just to film the day in the life of fire uh, fire people, and the plane hit the two twin uh, the World Trade Center, two of them, the twin towers that morning, and it was it was havoc. George W. Bush was the president of the United States. Nineteen years in the anniversary of nine eleven. Next year, we're going to celebrate the 20th anniversary of 9-11, if I still have my YouTube channel. But yeah, here we are 19 years later. I'm almost crying about it, about 9-11. This is coming up to, I was seeing some videos here and all about, and there was callers who, call, who called their loved ones in that airplane. The loved ones called from, their, from the airplane that was hijacked, 
from the uh, from the plane to the ground. Uh, for all those calls that went through those cell phone calls, um, it was a it was a it was a big uh, it was it was an airplane. It was an uh, was it seventy? Anyways, this, I forgot the number of the airplane, but it was a jumbo jet. It was a jumbo jet carrying all these passengers flying where they need to go. But all of a sudden, a hijackers had their plans to hijack the plane. This was way back in 19 years ago. Mind you, this is 19 years ago. Um, so we're hitting the 19th anniversary of 9-11. This come in September. Um, it's so eerie to a lot of people. Donald Trump has mentioned it several times through him being the president of the United States about 9-11. We're coming up to 19 years. Can you believe it, everybody in the United States? And we have this pandemic called Convert 19. Um, they don't mix. They really don't mix. But yeah, here we are with the virus going on. 9-11 and uh, 19 years later, well, actually, whatever. Anyway, it's been 19 years since 9-11. And don't get me wrong, um, I watched it that morning. I kid you not, folks. Uh, it happened as it happens live on TV, where everybody was watching New York area. And this gone on for about almost two days. People, um, those two buildings came crashing down, crashing down. It's like a pan, pan they call it the pancake effect or a cake effect. Um, and all the people that were near the Twin Towers had to run away from 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 the city area, from those Twin Towers, from the World Trade Center. It was a tackle, right? Attack on uh, American soil. And uh, first time ever in American soil. First time in American soil they tacked airplane. These are terrorism. They call, they dubbed it Terrorism, uh, terrorist attack. That's what they deemed it as. They attacked people, civilians. They call them civilians. These were people working in those two towers. A lot of people working there, they all died. From the airplane to the building. Um, all died. I don't know what the number was, but you guys can figure it out. It was in the billions. It was in the billions. Billions... <laughs> It's hard for me to even say this. It's still to this day. The numbers in the billions. So, yeah, not just the airplane, not the people just in the airplane, but the people in the building as well. If there were survivors, that's great. I'm not going to mention names here because not because I don't want to. It's just because there might be a lot of names I could be saying who survived it or who didn't. Um, so I'm not going to do here nor there. About it, so we just say we just say, I mourn to those people who lost loved ones in the nine eleven. We cry for you out there, as a me. I'm crying right now. Just think about it. nineteen years since nine eleven, and here we are in July, in July of twenty twenty, around a few days after Canada Day, and I'm astounding. Nineteen years ago. Can't believe it. We still have the Convert 19. This is astounding. My best friend, who I know for since '87, is long gone in this world, and still I'm quite uh, torn about that. Really torn about that, folks. So yeah, 19 years ago, 9/11 happened. To that point on, we now have SARS to thank, and now the pandemic. So if it's not going to be 9-11, it's going to be the pandemic. It's going to kill a lot of people. Um, we have to wear masks. And it's not 9-11. This is just to do a pandemic, the ill of uh, the uh, the um, COVID-19 we have to deal with in the year 2020. But 19 years later, this coming September, September 11th, 2001, 19 years later, we're coming up to the anniversary of it. Next year, not this year, but next year, is going to be the 20th anniversary of that fateful morning, that fateful day. 
when hijackers hijacked the airplane, zoomed it into a, two towers, two twin towers, the World Trade Center, and blew up. The people that were in the airplane perished. Um, the people that were in those twin towers had to escape all the way down to the bottom of the uh, the ground floors. And it was a terrible day, terrible day for the New Yorkers. Uh, did I say any more? So, folks, it's a terrible day. We're we're heading to nineteen, the nineteenth anniversary to nine eleven. This coming year, it's still astounding to me. It's still astounding to me. But yeah, nineteen years ago, nine eleven happened, and uh, this is my story uh, of the uh, terrorist attack on nine eleven. So I will put that here. It's a sad moment for a lot of other people. I lost my best friend, not to do to 9-11, due to his passing of himself. And uh, I want to say thank you for all you people for staying through thick and thin. And I'll put this as 9-11 uh, attack. Okay? So there you go, folks.